What's up guys? Someone asked me to make a video on adding real life food props and drinks and stuff to their 5M server, which we're going to be using Ox Inventory. So just go to Ox Inventory, go to your data, items, and this is where your items are going to be in your database. You got your shops and everything here. So for the example today, we'll be using Chalk Shake and Frost Donut. Chocolate Shake, Frosted Donut. So this is your spawn name, so name it something short. You got Chalk Shake. Frost, frost donut for this label this is the spawn name for what it shows up as in your inventory weight how much it weighs set it up for your server stack that's if you can uh, put multiple items into one slot stack or close it's if you should uh, close the inventory on use client so thirst and hunger one set up for drinks one set up for food same with your animations, so you have like your loot bottle or your eaten burger. Make sure to set it up if it's a food or drink. And then for your prop, that's what I'll be showing you. So this is going to be important, so you'll change up the prop name. You also have your positioning and everything, which you don't really have to mess with if you just install what I show you. So you got your use time which is set in milliseconds so 5500 is 5.5 seconds this one's 7500 so 7.5 seconds and then you got your notifications so you drink chocolate shake or yum frosty donut so once you get all this set up you can also go into your shops and add those items so you got chalk shake frost donut make sure it matches up with your spawn names and don't have an example for like burger and water so you can just copy and paste and use that so, what you want to do is go online, go to GitHub, and they'll have this link for uh, PS Props. It's a free download. It has all kinds of shakes and drinks and stuff, vapes. So, once you install it, you'll have a stream and an FX manifest. Make sure to take that folder. And what I usually do is I'll make a new folder called Props, and I'll put brackets around it. Make sure it's cap sensitive. And uh, ensure in your CFG so we have the MLO close pack and all that so ensure props and inside that props folder you're gonna have all the food packs and stuff you have so this one we have PS props make sure it has your stream and manifest to run that's important so you go into your stream we're using shake cherry just make sure to like just rename copy go into your items and make sure the prop is whatever you just copied. So just paste that into here. And then same for food. So this one's the BZZ food pack, donut 001. So we'll just go to props. And this one's BZZ food pack. You can find this one online free as, as well. And just stream, find donut 001. Just copy and paste that name into your items. So just make sure it's here. And that's pretty much all there is to it. I'll just restart your server, make sure everything's saved. And oh yeah, you can also add PNGs. So you can like find PNGs online of a donut or a shake. And make sure it's transparent, that way it doesn't have like a white background or anything to it. And just go to Ox Inventory, and go to your web images. This is where all your PNGs are at, so just drag that into there and save it. Throw that in the server and start it up. Make sure to restart the server for everything to take effect. I use FileZilla to, FileZilla to transfer all my uh, folders into the server. Use that posting for actual server. I'm not sure what you use to restart. You also use TX admin. If you ever need a server to join, we should be opening up in a few weeks. Got a lot of cool stuff, custom cars, clothing, a bunch of jobs, items, a lot of cool stuff, a bunch of custom scripts. We got the multi-character setup, so pretty cool. Alright, so I'm at a shop now. 
So I'll bring in my inventory. Go to my shop. And you'll see the items that we added. So this is all the items I've added in my server. So I got Pepsi, Red Bull, Monster, Snickers, Twix, Coke, a bunch of stuff. So we added a frosted donut, chocolate shake. So let's go use and you'll see the prop. And you'll have the progress bar and it'll match up to whatever time you put for the use time. And you'll get notification, young frosty donut in the top right for Oxlib. And this one's the chocolate shake. Yeah, that's pretty much all there is to it. So just make sure to uh, restart the server and all that should take effect. So if you ever need a video on how to add custom cars or clothing or anything, I can do that as well. So make sure to subscribe. Peace.